opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. d5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. nf3 develops the knight toward the center and protects the d4 pawn. nf6 protects the d5 pawn and controls the e4 square. c4 gains space on the queen's side, prepares to develop the knight to c3, and invites black to give up control of the e4 square after dx c4. c6 supports the d5 pawn and allows the queen to develop on the queen's side. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts to fight for the e4 square. a6 is a popular move that keeps white guessing where the light squared bishop will develop or if black will play e6. e3 supports the d4 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. It is the last book move. This is a fair move. It is good. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. It is good. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. It is good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This adds pressure by pinning a knight. It is excellent. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. Castling develops a rook while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is excellent. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is excellent. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. That's fine. It is good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. Very precise. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is good. This threatens to kick a knight. It is good. A solid choice. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. Takes back. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The pawn is now adequately defended. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players.